Hello everybody, this is gonna be a trade recap on ES. The reason I wanna explain it is because of Valo area breakouts and basically Valo breakouts, okay? So this morning I said finally hitting the daily level, also swing fell a pattern of previous day high. And also we were coming back inside the Valo area of this small range. Just come here, let me delete this for a second. I'm gonna zoom in. Okay, let me just pull out the fixed range. So essentially that's the fixed range. So you, the way the way something works in order to find value is the following way. So you see here we take the short setup and then coming into the point of control and then bouncing away. This means this right here is a failure to rotate. So essentially if something is failing to rotate to either value area high or value area low, this means that it's looking to break out of this value okay so essentially this is the most um of the scenario that we see about value area breakouts so essentially failure to rotate to the downside means it's gonna look for higher prices and essentially you know making that new high breaking above the daily coming into the previous day point of control this for sure means that the price is gonna look for higher prices so yeah the way value area works is that basically failing to rotate to one of the directions means price is gonna look for value in the other way so here you know simply said failing to rotate to the bottom side of the value area e.g the value area low means that it's gonna probably break to the upside and look for higher prices essentially this is a bullish bullish thing and if, if the same thing happens to the downside it means that's a bearish thing so we have both things on the table. If you have any questions about this trade recap, let me know.